Oh, brother, can you spare a dime or a quarter or even a penny? You've probably heard that there's a national shortage of coins. Well, the change will do you good. Out there somewhere with George Escala. So on the streets, they tell me spare change is sparse. I've heard my friends say that like stores don't have change. Sign of these times in stores, they're saying your coins are needed. What's up with that? I think you got a few people hoarding it and uh, they're trying to max it out. Whatever the reason now, coinage is hard to come by. I mean, do you have any spare change on you? No. Because there isn't any change. Eyes on my car. <laughs> yeah. So you're hoarding it? Yes. So the story is coins are in short supply, so the law of economics say that makes them more valuable, supply and demand. So here's about, oh, nine or ten pennies. Would people stop and pick them up if they see them on the sidewalk? Yep. Why not? You know? Maybe a quarter, but I can't sit not a nickel or a dime. We'll put it to the test. Pennies not from heaven, but from me on the sidewalk. So there they were on Broad Street, free for the taking, in the middle of a national coin shortage. These pennies caught some eyes, but people just kept walking. Would you bend over and pick up pennies right now? A quarter, not a penny. But not ten pennies, even if you almost trip over them. There's probably good reason no one stopped. They're just pennies, and there's COVID. I guess that makes sense. Out there somewhere in Augusta, George Escola, WJBF, News Channel 6. And right now to pick those up. No, I'm <laughs> racing you down there. We, we got to beat the storm and the people to get that nine cents.